Keith Thurman is his name. Now, you got to know boxing to know Keith Thurman. Because Keith Thurman ain't known by everybody. But he's known in a boxing fraternity. He's a former champion. Pretty damn good, actually. Um, I saw him lose to Manny Pacquiao. I don't know how the hell he lost that fight. Got dropped, too. Got dropped, too. Um, that's the only loss of his career, to be quite honest with you. Keith Thurman is 30-1. and one. Keith Thurman has 22 knockouts in his career. Last time we saw him fight was on February 5th of 2022 where he fought Mario Barrios. Didn't look that impressive. Um, people were not that enamored with him. Um, and it's been hard for him to get fights ever since. Prior to that, Manny Pacquiao dropped him um, and ultimately went on to outbox him and win a split decision that I thought honestly should have been unanimous. Um, but again, he's 30 and one. He's from Clearwater, Florida, 30 and one um, with 22 knockouts. He's never been knocked out, although he's been knocked down and he's relatively inactive because it's hard for him to get fights. Nevertheless, he's made news. And the reason why he's made news is because he shocked boxing fans by accepting a challenge called out by the extraordinary female boxer that is Clarissa Shields. Um, if you've seen Clarissa, Cl Clarissa Shields fight, you know what I'm talking about. It's the sister can box. She will kick your ass. Make no mistake about it. She is no joke. Um, to my producers, we don't need to see Keith Thurman right now. We need to, you need to put up Clarissa Shields. That's who, the, that's who the public needs to see her. She is no joke. Um, she can fight. That is her in a boxing ring right now fighting a man. That's who, that's who she's fighting. That's what she does. Clarissa Shields is no joke. She taunted Keith Thurman, told him she wanted to fight he initially shunned it, then thought about it and said he would only do it for charity. And if she's willing to do it for charity, he will accept. She's fired numerous shots in his direction on multiple occasions in recent years, but reiterated her call out of him over the weekend. She's the pound for pound king in women's boxing. She's 14 and 0, only two knockouts, though. Thurman is a former unified welterweight champion who's only lost to Manny Pacquiao, as I told you. Um, Shields tweeted, quote, I'll fight Thurman at 154 pounds. So serious. All the respect in the world to him, too. I just think I can outbox him. Thurman told Sporting News, I did not see it, but I've already got text messages all about it. Look, I can fight for any charity event. We can raise money and let you try to showcase your skills and talent. Thurman later said, I would wear bigger gloves. I would let her wear smaller gloves. I would let her wear headgear, too. I don't really want to punch a girl in the face. <sighs> I don't want to rain on Clarissa Shields parade because I want her to get whatever she wants. I got a lot of respect for her. Um, Thurman, what I would say to you is that, my brother, it's a no-win situation. Bigger gloves while she's wearing smaller gloves, headgear, whatever. Unless you're going to go in there and let her punch you without you punching her at all, without you trying to win at all, without you, without, without you competing, you just want to be a punching bag, unless that's what you're talking you talk about doing. Here are the scenarios. You're going to hit her and have women groups complaining about how you hit a woman. You're hitting on a woman. Or... She's going to kick your ass. Neither is a winnable situation for you. One's more embarrassing than the other. Both are troublesome. Why? Why, bro? You're 30 and 1 with 22 KOs. We just saw Errol Spence get beat bad, pretty badly. You get a couple of fights under your belt. Make some noise with a couple of knockouts, you'd be 32 and one. You trying to tell me you can't get a fight against men who are real fighters? Again, I appreciate the charity portion, 
And I understand that Clarissa is just saying she believes she could outbox you. And hell, it's not, I can't rule it out. She's phenomenal. I'm just saying, as a man, there's no win. You either are going to be accused of hitting on a woman or you're going to get you're going to get beat up by a woman. Both are very, very bad scenarios. Don't do it. That's just me. Don't do it.